Hello internet. Today I've come for a day trip to test out my completed camper car thing. I finished tinkering. Now I have this board which rests upon two of these boxes. The memory foam mattress thing goes on top. Planks put everything together and pillows just for comfiness. I'm testing it out today. I'm currently sat looking out with the boot open at some birds of prey on like marshland. And it's really pretty. I'll show you what I can see. That is a nice view. who forgets to film outros. I'm at home now. I had a lovely day out. I think we probably spent about somewhere between an hour or two just relaxing in the car after we'd had our fish and chips. So I was like lying on the fully made out bed. I had the boot open. I was looking out of the view. There was like birds swooping and tweeting to each other. I th I'm definitely thinking of taking up twitching as a hobby when I'm retired. We went to Parkgate, which I don't think I actually said before. And we were the youngest people there by about 10 to 20 years. It was lovely. I highly recommend it if you're under that age group and fancy a little boost. Do you have any suggestions of where you think I should go for my first overnight camp? As you, most of you know, I'm based in the northwest, but I don't mind driving a bit. So if it's somewhere magical and it's down south, fuck it, chuck it in the comments, give me a suggestion, because there's a good chance I might drive down and have a look. Equally, I will drive upwards. If there's somewhere beautiful, I don't know, in Scotland, that you're like, go here, it's perfect. I like the idea of somewhere that's out the way and kind of quiet, but, you know, like, it doesn't have to be too quiet. Somewhere in the middle or either somewhere right in the middle of nowhere. I don't want to be sleeping in a city in my car, you know, somewhere where I can go for a nice walk, somewhere outdoorsy. I want a bit of nature. Right, I'll see you all in the next video. Thank you very much for watching if you stayed this long. And thank you to all of my patrons on Patreon. Mwah.